Now, I remember I interviewed Trina. Yeah. And you guys were in a relationship at some point. Yeah, we were cool at that point. Yeah. She said that when you came to Miami, you would stay with her. Yeah. And no, 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 it was real cool at that point. It, was, it no. was a real, you yeah, know, it was a real thing. She spoke highly of you. No, I speak highly of her every time, too. Yeah. Well, me and French was never in a relationship. We were friends. He was a great friend of mine, were. And um, I just think sometimes in a friendship, you need to learn the friend. You need to build with that person to make sure this is the person that you really want to be around and a person that you're giving your energy and your time to. You're with almost every single day for almost two years. Uh, she introduced you to the Kardashians. Hell no. No? Hell no. That's not true. Okay. Hell no. I, will, um, I met... I met Chloe when I went to a uh, to studio session with Ross. Ah, okay. Chloe was actually in the studio, her and Scott Disick, with Ross and Meek Mill. That's how you met Chloe? Yeah. Because at one point, you started dating Chloe. Yeah. How was I, that? Met, I, met, I met her that night. Actually, I met her that night. That's how it happened. I met her that night with, um, with Ross and Meek, because she had went to like a Ross concert or something earlier in that day. Mm-hmm. Um, and I went there. I didn't get her number at the studio. I went back to um, I went back to my crib, and I had a puff. I'm like, yo, I saw Chloe. I want her to come with me to this thing that that I had. Cause when I when I saw her in the studio, I asked, I was like, yo, you want to come with me to this show? She was like, yeah. But I never grabbed her number right there. Mm-hmm. I had a puff. I'm like, yo, you got her number? And Puff sent her a text like, yo, French wants your number. She was like, give it to him. Then I got her number. I texted her, and we start, you know, we start kicking it. Yeah, I think uh, you and me were at uh, Puffy's son's birthday party in L.A. Yeah. And the two of you were hanging out. I remember you yeah, guys yeah. introduced us. Yeah, yeah, At that point. And I was like, oh, can I take a picture with her? And you're like, no, no, no. She, <laughs> <laughs> she don't take pictures. Like, things are really, yeah, yeah, you was, know, that was, that was serious low. with the Kardashians and pictures. No, nah, no, it was low key. It was very low key. But yeah, I remember I, the, the only time I met her was with, with you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, That one night. Um, and... It seemed like you guys got a little serious. I think she even said that, you know, she'd love to marry you at one point. Yeah. What happened? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what happened. Because um, you were going through a divorce at this time. Yeah, no, this, this is way after. Oh, is it? Because, yeah. well, I think you settled the divorce right around that time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, think I, was, yeah, I went through my divorce. Then, you know, I think I was just, I was just having fun. You know what I'm saying? I thought I was having fun with life and, and, and... You weren't ready to settle down. Yeah, I think I just came from a five-year relationship and I was just, you know, I was moving, this and that. But, you know, for, for, the, for the time I spent with all of them, you know, I, you know, I appreciate every moment of it, but was no, it I was a- just... I, yeah, I was just... I had too much things to accomplish. Fair enough. Too much to do. 